Hi, my name is Steve Ezude. Welcome to my Two Minutes Tuesday when I give you tips and advice on how to achieve your real estate goals and objectives, be it buying or selling. Today, I'm speaking to you about tapping into the rich people's principle and mentality. And that will help you grow. How? Here's how. They take advantage of that. You and I, an average person, will be like, oh, why should I take on that? But the rich people, they master the art of utilizing that. Here's how. For example, you owe the bank money or you have a loan, a home equity line of credit. An average person will be like, oh, I don't want that. I want to pay it off. But you know the rich man's aptitude? He wants to accumulate more debt. So a typical example is here's what I do and I tell my clients to use my examples. So my line of credit was about for a well, line of an example. So it was about $400,000. And um, I had an option to pay it off. But I said, no, it doesn't make business sense. It doesn't make investment sense to pay this off. Why? You will ask. The point is that the cost of borrowing in, in this Canadian market real estate market is so cheap. Now, the average in interest rate is about 1.6, 1.7. So I go to my bank, I say, hey, bank, I want to refinance or I want to pay this out. I said, no, no, I don't want to do that. So we calculated the interest for this over a two year period and they said it's 1.7%. So, and I said, I want to fix it. What's the cost of fixing this? This will, this will drive you not. You know the cost, 1.7% of $400,000 is roughly $1,700. In two years fixing, this will be like $3,300 or $3,400. So, isn't this insane? This is no brainer. Why should I pay off $100,000? When I can borrow this money, put it into an investment property, and in one year, I'm making about 15% profit on that. So why should I pay off 1700 So in two years, it's about 3004 In two years, the property, if I buy property, will be accumulating about uh, fifteen to $30,000. So what is thirty? What is $3,400 compared to between $15,000 and $30,000. And that's the deal. Hope this helps. Do not rush to pay off your debt. Use it smartly. There are good debts, there are bad debts. This is an example of good debts. I hope this helps. Thank you.